Hi guys, I'm back later, which is right now. So we read until a lot of stories last time. So today I'm going to read two chapters or one. Okay. Goodbye, silk pajamas. Thea tried to review the situation. According to my Calculations. We should be right near Treasure Island," she said. Then she pointed to a black and white dot in the sky. A plush can. That means we are really close. Just then, Trap gave gave a loud shriek. I jumped. What is it? Do you always have to shout like that? I complained. I've got an idea. He squeaked in my ear. Then he grabbed the trunk's handle, trying to lift the lid. What are you doing? Do you want to throw us all back in the water? I protested. Trap was waving his arms around in the air. We are flapping your arms! I shouted at him. Are you going to tell us you can fly? Can fly now too? Trap kept waving excitedly. Pajamas, belt, blue stripes! He cried. Finally, he managed to rip my comfy blue and white striped pajamas out of the trunk. Then he tore them into two pieces. I, I really am a genius. I'm so clever. It frightens me at times. My cousin giggled. Giggled. <laughs> he was beginning to sound like a rat who's. Eaten one too many slices of American cheese. We'll just use this rag to to make a sail. Rag? You call this a rag? I screamed. These are my silk pajamas with silver buttons. They cost me a fortune. They have my antennas embroidered in gold. Well, isn't that just? Like you to be so selfish," Trap sighed. "We are talking about a treasure here, and you're worried about your pajamas, Geronimo. You amaze me. I gnash my teeth together. Don't call me Geronimo. My name is Geronimo. Geronimo, got it? There was nothing left to do now but rig up Trap." Traps pajama still and take off. We were all terribly thirsty. My tongue feels like it got stuck in the sandbox as Scampern Town Park mumbled. Trap, I would give anything for some ice cream. Do you remember what ice cream powder the icy rat, the air condition, the air conditioning in that place was always full blast. You could freeze your fur off just waiting for your hot cheese sundae. Sweet dripped down my snout. Why did Trap had to go on about ice cream? I was starting to have visions of cheddar cheese sugar cones floating on the water. The next morning, a peal of thun- thunder shook the sky. I licked my th- snout and. It was covered with drops, drops of water. The wind was, the rain was paddling down like a jet of a shower. I think it's a good thing because you can like drink water. I swallowed the drops that fell on trap and danced their paws off. See, see. I was right. Ha <laughs> ha. Then, as suddenly as it had come, the rain stopped. We hugged. Then, winding our tails together, we squeaked. Friends together, mice forever. Ben was the first one to reach the island. So, I am going to read until here, and for the next chapter, it's the real. Excitement. I hope you have a good Wednesday again, and I hope I'll see you 
tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow. So, bye. Have a good day.